Hi everyone, this is Kate Schwenke and I'm going to be doing a requested packing video for you. This is how I pack my Jujube Be Quick as a purse and I do this quite often whenever I am able to get out by myself uh, without the kids. This is how I would pack my bag. This print is called Toki Perky and it is from the Toki Doki and Jujube collaboration and it's just so pretty. I love it. It's probably one of my favorite prints ever. So I'm going to go ahead and show you uh, one of the first things that I do when I use a Be Quick as a purse is I will use a short strap from a set piece. This is from my uh, custom set that I had made uh, by my friend Christine. And I will link them together like this. Just, you know, the regular clasp links. You can just link them like that and then attach one to one of the D-rings on the side and the other one, of course, is sewn into the bag. So I would just join those two straps together and that actually is the perfect length to fit right under your arm. So if you're liking how you can wear a, a bag on your shoulder like that, you would wear it this way. Um, otherwise, I have another strap. This is a strap that I had my friend, uh, Micah Letisa Whitley, she made this for me. And this is just like a silver uh, adjustable strap and it's nylon and you would hook it just right here and right here and this can be worn crossbody and if you were to do it that way you would just take this off and it would just completely remove and then you would have just this and if I was to use it crossbody with this strap then I would open this and I would attach my keys to this instead, instead of just leaving them loose in there like that. And that way, if I'm looking for it, I can just pull them right out. So I'm going to go ahead and show you, first of all, kind of how I have this um, on the outside. So this is how it would look like if you were to use it just crossbody. So on the outside here, I had my friend Andrea. She made this beautiful Toki Perky fob for me. And uh, that I just hang on to one of the D-rings on the sides here. I just tend to put them on the, I guess if I'm wearing it, it would be on the right hand side. But on in the video, I always put them on the left here. So that's all there is <laughs> to the quick. It's just pretty much one zipper across the top. And there you go. So that is the outside, how I have it done with the strap and my fob. And I'm going to go ahead and show you a little bit of how I have this on the inside. So like I said, I have my keys on here, so I'm going to show you how that kind of looks in there. So this is how I have it set up. You would just zip this close over this, and then the strap would kind of be hidden inside. But if you need your keys, they are attached to that. It works really great. I do this all the time. So this is how I have it set up in here. I have my phone in the back zipper pocket here. Normally I would have that zipped, I don't know why I left it open. Um, I have my tissues here, I have a coin purse, my wallet, and a small set piece, and some lotion down there. So I'm gonna go ahead and show you kind of how I had each thing set up and pull everything out for you. So in the very front here, like I said, I had my wallet. This is the Petunia Pickle Bottom Wonderless Wallet in Casba Nights. And this wallet actually fits really great in a Be Quick. So that was right in the front. Right behind that, I had my Mr. Gray coin purse. And in here I just have punch cards and insurance cards and things like that. If I had to go run off to the hospital for some reason, um, then I would have what I need. All right, and right behind that, I had just a little tissue pack. I have bad allergies, so always have to have tissues with me. Now into my small set piece. This is, like I said, um, from a custom B set that I had made by my friend Christine. So it's got my perfect print placement on it. Miss Donatella and the Cactus Babies. Now, I love the zippers on these. They just go right down the sides and they open up so nice. This is a little bit bigger than a normal small set piece though, too, by the way. So in here I have my Sweet Mint EOS. 
I have a little pill case. This has some Midol, Tylenol, Advil, things like that. I also have some eye drops, a couple of hair ties, my little folding brush with my mirror in there, a couple of panty liners, and a couple pieces of gum. So that's all I had in there. And then I had my lotion. It's very dry up here in New York, so I have to have that. And in the very, very back pocket here, like I said, I just have my phone back there. And this is an iPhone 5, and it fits really, really great in that pocket. I don't know if you could fit anything much bigger. I mean, this still has a lot of space, I guess, so you probably could. I'm not sure how big the other, the new phones are. These days, they look like massive <laughs> compared to this one. But that's uh, how I have it. And I also kind of wanted to show you the difference between how big a Be Quick is and how large the large set piece is packed as a, a purse. So this is the large set piece. It is a custom set piece, but it is the, same, the exact same size as a regular large set piece. So this is the difference in size right here. If you can see that. The Be Quick is larger, but this one has more structure to it. It can stand pretty much on its own. If I had something in it, it wouldn't have fallen over. But the Be Quick is, it's thinner and um, doesn't have structure to it. So I'm going to go ahead and show you how I would pack my large set piece as a purse. And it does not, I mean, it does have a long, a long strap if I was to have one made, but I don't. So I'm going to use my, my custom uh, little strap here that I had made for me. And I would just hook that onto both sides and this would be just worn crossbody. So there you go. Oh, I cannot forget this. This is like a must have. <laughs> I love this thing. I'm obsessed with my fobs, what can I say? So, all right, I love the double zipper on top. And this is a custom piece. So um, Christine did add an extra zipper in there, so it's kind of like a quick in that way. So I'm going to go ahead and show you how everything fits in here too. So I would put my wallet in. It's a little bit snugger because it's not as big, like I said, and I might not be able to fit as much in here. I'm going to try and put my phone in this back pocket here too. All right, so that fit. Next see if I can fit everything into the small set piece again and see if that fits in there. Hopefully it does. I have not tried this yet, so this is kind of a fun trial. <laughs> Alright, so that's everything that I had in there before. Okay. Um, my small set piece does fit in there. It's a little bit more snug, like I was saying before. It's not as big, so... Um, I was able to fit that, so question is, what else is more important? I don't need to pack my lotion, so we'll try to pack these two things. I'm going to do it upright. Will that fit? Oh, I might be able to fit my, my lotion in still. So that's how I have this. I have my phone back here, small set piece, wonderless wallet, tissues, coin purse, and see if this goes on top. Not ideal, but we will see if it fits. <gasps> Look at that, yay. Oh, yep, barely, but it does. <laughs> I definitely had more space in the other one, but there you go. I can also use this as a purse now too. So uh, hopefully this has been helpful for you if you're looking to use um, one of the large set pieces or a Be Quick as a purse. They work really great for me every time I've ever used one when I'm out. I It actually kind of eliminated the use, the need for me to buy an actual purse because I don't carry much on me as you can see. So um, oh you know what I didn't add? Hmm. I don't think that my lotion is going to fit anymore because I definitely need my keys in there. <laughs> Ta-da! Alright, so obviously if did not fit my lotion like it did in the other bag. So there you go, there, must have the keys. All right, so there you go. Anyways, <laughs> sorry for my goofy video, but uh, thanks for watching.